Halloween's coming up, and who doesn't like haunted houses? Not to bore you, but when I was a kid, my brother and his friends built their own haunted house. Things on a string, plastic monster body parts, a little WD-40, a lighter had burned down, whatever. But ever since then, I know for sure, I've always been fascinated with the whole do-it-yourself style haunted house or backyard haunted house or even those people that do um, effects and things at their front door you know for for trick-or-treaters in that same vein i created this the raspberry pi powered scary door or halloween effects door the idea is simple it looks like a door on an ordinary house it has a window in it looks like you can see into the house and it's dark but when in fact right behind the door is an lcd screen where the user whoever builds this can play scary videos Pick, put pictures up, scary pictures. Around the door, I put a series of air pistons run off an air compressor. The idea is to control them in time with the video or series of pictures that you're going to show. And the idea is, is to give the monster behind the door effect by timing the piston firings along with the video that I'm playing. In this first example, the goal is, is to lure in the person visiting your house with a false sense of security. Looks like a normal scene, nothing too special. That one's actually my favorite example. And another one is to try to get people to see something odd right away. I'm going to approach the door and run a test. I set up the enforcer beam brake sensor on the floor here. I would imagine you would set this up somewhere between, I don't know, uh, the street and the door to trigger it from a distance. So as you can see, it's somewhat far away. So triggered. I see it to a house. Very, you know, just very typical. TV's a little close to the door, but you know. Now for the scariest aspect of this whole project. The wiring. Let's take a look here. Let's get further away. Here are the pistons. They're under pressure right now, so I cannot move them. Manifold block, airline, power, and so forth. This is this is running one of the Raspberry Pis. The Raspberry Pi block, Pi face, eight relay. All right, let's trigger this. Let's look at it from the back. Alright, I'm at 80 PSI. I'm going to see if it does any more damage to the door at double the pressure. Tripping. 
see what happens. Jeez. As you can see, the pistons hit really hard. And the problem with that is, when I first ran it, it they put six major dents in the front of the door. So to overcome the problem, what I ended up doing was placing, I just ended up taping strike pads, uh, an extra couple layers of sheet metal over the areas in which the pistons hit. So, for future reference. Halloween. I guess everyone's entitled to one good scare. Scare, scare. <laughs>